Well, hi, family. Happy Friday. Uh, thank God it's Friday. Had a, had a pretty rough week, but man, here we are. Uh, I have been testing a company for, I guess you call it testing. I just, I just love this product. So I've been using some oil and balm by a company. Revered Grooming Company. Their website is amazing. It's pretty cool. I like them. Papito is the owner. Anyways, just have to say some things that have happened to me. Let me put this ring back on. Uh, over the week, I started, got it Tuesday, put it in Tuesday. No, it was Wednesday morning. So Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and here it is Friday evening. Um, just the oil, which is revered, the turncoat, and the balm. Let me tell you the scent profile of this. Let me go to here, beard oil, turncoat. $17.99 for the oil. And the ingredients are sweet almond oil, avocado oil, grapeseed oil, jojoba oil, uh, and virgin organic rosehip oils. Um, it's a one ounce. It's Indian Oud, which I'm really loving. I think Indian Oud is amazing. Uh, lemon, bergamot, or bergamot, cedar, and vanilla bean. Um, the set profile on this in both is a sweet, seductive powerhouse of a, of a scent profile. The stank is amazing, long lasting, all day long. Uh, I have had more compliments from the scent that comes off of this oil. Not one bad thing is said. Uh, the most on this scent um, and the most compliments on the way my beard is styled and dialed in all day long uh, for the last three days. In probably the last three years, I have worn products in my beard that are, you know, top shelf. Um, and that's what I'm calling this right now is a top shelf. Uh, it's right up there with the Lux and the Nicholas Beard Works, um, Kingsman, uh, I would even say Fable, uh, Honest Ape, uh, Crusher's Creation. I mean, it's up there. Uh, another one, Barn Brand Beards. His uh, Ghost Buck is, I mean, it's, it's, this one stands out the most to me in all of the Udes that I've had. Uh, probably this one and Ghost Buck from Barn Brand Beards are the most dynamic and complex scents, strong, long-lasting uh, scent profiles that I've had in an Oud. Um, I mean, you got the Kingsman. I mean, Legendary is great, but those two on my beard, I, I mean, within three hours, probably the scent profile goes away on them. But on on this one, on Revered, all day long. And like I say, it is a sweet and seductive, uh, manly, musky, uh, just delicious, delicious fragrance. Um, and a lot of people have noticed. Um, and the way that it is in my beard, I get up in the morning and I'll put the scent in it or I'll put the oil in, let it sit for five, six minutes while I'm getting ready, comb it through and then hit it with the balm and all day long hold. I mean, it's, you comb it once or twice. I'll, I comb my beard a lot during the day and it doesn't go away. Uh, at the end of the evening or when I come home from lunch after, I get a lunch after about seven hours of working. Uh, I'll, I may put some more in. I didn't have to. I tried it one day and I didn't put any more in. And I could still smell it in the evening before I went to bed when I put some more of this balm in. Uh, amazing. I'm telling you. It, it's You hit it out of the park on this one, Pepito. Um, it blew my mind. I mean, I'm sure there's more out there that I haven't tried that are going to blow my mind. But this, this scent profile right here is so good that I went today. It was payday for me. I went and got his other two fragrances. Uh, scent profiles, excuse me, to be manly about it. We don't want to call it fragrances. <laughs> Anyways, the other ones he has are Revolution and Yorktown. Uh, let's go Yorktown first. Uh, you've got, and this this sounds complex as well too, uh, Pink Pepper, which I've never heard of, Nutmeg, 
Apple Vetiver, which I really want to get into some Vetiver. Uh, star Anise, which I think that's kind of a licorice smell, I think. Uh, and Patchouli. How strong and awesome are those combinations? It's just, it's intriguing me, and I'm, I know my mind is going to be blown on that one. Uh, and then let's go to Revolution. And the scent profile on Revolution, guys, is Lavender, Pineapple, Verbena, Tonka, Cranberry. I'm not much of a flowery, lavender, rosy kind of a guy, but off of this right here, his turncoat, I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say that. I'm not gonna hold back from this. Just to how amazing this scent profile is. Let me show you the what. Look at these bottles. I mean, white bottles with black. That is so sick, so awesome. Let me get my big fat head out of here. And everybody says that's George Washington Pepito. I don't know if that's George Washington with a skull or not or a mask on, but those are just amazing. Ingredients right there. I mean, just well thought out. Um, let me show you the oil. I think I've already done this last time, but it's just, a, it's kind of got an amber color to it. It's real clean. It's really good. I mean, I've used a lot of this stuff, so I'm probably going to have to end up getting, this isn't going to, this is going to go fast. Um, and then the balm. Well, I've been using using it for a while now. And it, it is the balm is a I didn't think it was gonna be a very good hold. You know, I thought thought it was gonna be a conditioning, but it's uh it's amazing. It's amazing how this stuff just goes in and the the holding power of this balm is phenomenal. And it also is a great conditioner at night. And it just absorbs into my beard. I mean, you feel, you think you're going to get some, because there's some out there that are greasy. This is not greasy at all. It absorbs into your beard, and after about probably five to ten minutes, you can run your fingers through it, and it's it's dry, but your beard is soft. That's one thing I've noticed with the oil and the balm. It is so soft and conditioned. It just feels like no other that I've had except maybe Luxurious Bastard and, and Fable uh, and Nicholas Beardworks. It's just something about those oils in my beard. Um, I think because of the components that they use, the carrier oils, that just absorb and are just top shelf. They spend a little bit more, I think. Which And they've been in the game for a while longer. So, Which, that's good. That's the way it should be. So let me go back here. Let me go to... How much the balms are. I mean, because it's the same scent profile between the two. The oil and the balm, exactly the same. And man, they work so good together. Right, let's go some. And the accessories or swag. Uh, he doesn't really have any right now. Um, but it's coming out. He's going to be coming out with some. And I can't wait, buddy, to get, to get that logo on a, a hoodie or a hat or a shirt. I mean, that's kick-ass. I mean, I'm telling you, don't mean to use that kind of language, but I'm gonna, it is, it's, it's going to be awesome. So I'm looking forward to getting some of that too. Um, the bombs, I was going to tell you that, tell you what's in those. Um, they are white beeswax, which it's the first ingredient. So I thought it would be a more of a, uh, a thicker kind of a balm, but it's not, uh, be white beeswax, organic coconut, Sweet almond, avocado, grape seed, jojoba, and virgin organic rosehip oils. Uh, it's a two ounce, and they are eighteen ninety nine. Absolutely great. So that's basically what I have to tell you right now about Revere Grooming Company. Uh, been waiting ever since Rob got on there and, and said anything about it. Rob, you, you were 100% correct on this. So Pepito, uh, got the other three coming. Can't wait for more scent profiles to come out with you or you to come out with. Um, absolutely amazing. Thankful I got this. Um, there's these companies I just love when they come out with products and you just wait and you wait and you wait and you finally end up getting it and it just blows. It goes above your expectations for uh, what an oil and a balm should be. Um, and his customer service, absolutely great so far. Every time I've, I've bugged him about this to get it, uh, he's told me just a little while longer. Uh, he held it a little bit longer because he didn't think that it was great. 
Um, I'm sure it was phenomenal before he, he had it perfected and before he thought that it was good enough to put out. But 100% gold star for stank, gold star for presentation, gold star for oil and balm. Just an amazing product, and I'm, I'm very thankful to get it. And if you trust my view and you trust my opinion on a product, uh, absolutely go out and get some of this. Spend that hard-earned money and go get you some of this. You will not be sorry. Uh, Mike Cribs approved, Swag Daddy approved, Beard Swag approved. Uh, go out and get some. Um, so anyways, uh, be good. Uh, enjoy your weekend. You got a couple of days off now after the grind, after your three day weekend. Uh, truly blessed. I'm thankful to be in this community. Uh, subscribe. And I should have done this before. I always forget. Subscribe and like. Uh, make a comment below. And if you have any questions, comment below and I'll, I'll make sure to answer. I answer everybody. Um, and have a blessed, blessed weekend with your family. Tell somebody you love them. Uh, tell somebody you're proud of them and family. I love you, um, and we'll be seeing you around. Have a great one.